Yeah, very good morning to everyone. Today we are discussing isometric projection. Again, we have uh, two combinations of solid. One is a square prism and one more is a cylinder. Here, the combination goes this way. In one view, it looks like this in a T shape. You can easily make a note that in the front view, this particular looks like a rectangle, wherein the cylinder part also looks like a rectangle. But when it is looked from the other view, it clearly looks like a cylinder. In this problem, they have given the front view and the side view of the problem. Based on that, you need to proceed. Now we shall look how to draw the same in an isometric sheet. We have two possibilities here. We can start the problem from the base or we can start from the top. For this problem, I will be starting from the top. So draw ISO 30 this side and ISO 30 this side and again from this point, again from this point. Complete this. Next, drop this ISO 60, ISO 60 and ISO 60. So after counting this, ISO 60 join these two points, remove the extra part. Again from this, join this and remove the extra part. Now you have got a square prism. Now identify the center of this. The length is ISO 60. Midpoint would be ISO 30. Identify midpoint of this sign join. Again from this identify the midpoint and drop a line like this. The diameter of a cylinder is 30 mm. So from the center mark this ISO 15 ISO 15 and join a line like this. After this, mark these two points to this corner. You can just join this way. This is done keeping this as a radius center and this as a radius. I will be drawing this curve. Similarly, mark these two midpoints join to opposite one. Again, keeping this as a center and this as a radius, join this arc. Next, the intersection of these two point lines, take this midpoint and draw this curve. Again, with this center, draw this curve. So after joining this and completing this particular part, what you need to do is, from these four corners, you can draw a line to the left side parallel to this or this 30 degree line and you can take a square similar to this particular one. After dragging all these lines, again identify the midpoints of this, join these two points to this left corner, keeping this as a center, this as a radius, draw an arc like this. Again, join these two center to this corner, keeping this as a center, this as a radius, draw one more arc. The intersection of these two lines, take this point and draw a curve and this point, draw a curve. Now, join this tangentially to this opposite curve that completes the problem. After joining all these things what you can do is you can erase this box part or else let it be retained with a thin line and join this axis to this point draw a line and at the end of the problem you can draw one horizontal line show 30 degree this side and 30 degree this side so this completes a problem thank you